गुड मॉर्निंग एवरीबडी वेलकम टू अवर टूडे सेशन टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी द लास्ट पार्ट ऑफ द फिफ्थ चैप्टर ऑफ जोग्राफी सो इन अवर अर्लियर सेशन वी हैव सीन द वाइल्ड लाइफ एंड द फॉरेस्ट ऑफ ब्राज़ील देर वी हैव सीन ब्राज़ील इज अ कंट्री वेयर ग्रेटर बायोडाइवर्सिटी फाउंड दैन एनी अदर कंट्री इन द वर्ल्ड सो वी हैव सीन that many types of animals and birds are found here here is the map of brazil is provided to you so there you can see in which areas of brazil which type of animals are found amazon river basin so there he, the bird hmm, candor which is a, a huge size bird and fly high in the sky that found again here golden lion tamarind also shown that is also found S animals various types of snakes rabbit and other birds also given in the picture so children suppose in the exam for four mark question locate the places at proper place or the locate the animals at the proper map of brazil so like that question will will be asked so there you have to feel the correct animal at the correct place amazon river basin which animals are found so that you have to locate at the exact place so like that see four mark question there is possibility that will ask otherwise they will give the same map with the pictures animals so exact like this map will be provided and they will ask some questions to you for question number 4b what observe the map carefully and answer the following questions so there are chances they will give both type of questions so see here india's map is given it is the blank map so here we have to look at the animals which found in india so i hope you understood what i want to say there is possibility they will provide like india's map complete blank map of here it is shown na india's blank map like that there is possibility brazil's complete total blank map provided in the exam so there you have to locate the animals and birds whatever they will ask at the exact place so for that you have to study the brazil's map carefully and as well as india's map also so i want to say that both the type of questions can ask on these two maps brazil and india now we will study the uh, this india wildlife so children this part this so that is deducted from your portion try this ha huh? india wildlife figure 5.5 so that is reduced from your syllabus and these questions also reduced from your syllabus so here these questions are reduced from your syllabus now we will move further to the geographical explanation India is also a mega diverse country in terms of wildlife means in our country also there is variety of animals birds are found there are many species of wildlife in India elephants are found in the hot and humid forest one horned rhinoceros are found in swampy and marshy lands of assam so see hot and humid forest there we can find elephants and marshy lands of assam and the swampy areas there we can find one horn rhinoceros wild ass and camels are found in arid lands arid land means like desert so snow leopards and yaks are found in the snow capped region of himalayas indian uh, bison deer elf sorry antelopes and monkeys are found in the peninsular region india is only country in the world where 
both tigers and lions are found so children see here it is said in which part of our country which type of animals are found for example himalaya no? himalaya is a very cold place so there snow capped region is available so there we can see yak and uh, snow uh, sorry yaks and um, leopards so that are found snow leopards are found in the peninsula region indian bison deer antelope and monkeys are found in the assam marshy land of assam there rhinoceros are found so you have to show these on the map of india where is the assam where are where from where to where we have to look at the himalaya mountain which is the peninsula region here so that we have to find out look it so next is given india is the only country in the world where both tigers and lions are found river rivers estuaries and coastal areas are homes of many turtles crocodiles and uh, gavials means gharial gharial it is uh, like uh, crocodile so these types of animal crocodile turtle gharial so that animals are found near the or in the rivers estuaries and coastal areas the forest and wetland are the shelters of variety of birds like peacock indian bustard kingfisher and pigeon duck etc so see students forest and wild wetland that are the shelters of variety of birds so names are given here peacock indian bustard kingfisher pigeon duck parakeets cranes and pigeons all these species make a land of unique habitat of wildlife so many species of wildlife are on the verge of extinction from india because of poaching poaching means illegal cutting of trees illegal cutting of forest pollution and rapid occurring deforestation example cheetahs so due to the poaching means illegal cutting of trees pollution and rapid deforestation due to that our wildlife in india are in danger because because many birds and animals they are they are on the verge of extinction for example here given cheetahs the government of india has set up number of national parks wildlife sanctuaries bird sanctuaries and biosphere biosphere reserves for the protection of wildlife and forest in india our government is trying to protect the wildlife to conserve the wildlife with that purpose there are number of national parks bird sanctuaries animal sanctuaries are are protect are providing the protection to the animals and birds so here wildlife sanctuaries bird sanctuaries biosphere reserves so these are for the protection of wildlife and forest in india so here we have completed our fifth chapter so here use your brain that part has re reduced from us syllabus so no need to study that part and these also give it a try so that is also reduced from your syllabus so we have reached to the end of this chapter we have seen the conclusion also here exercise is given on the basis of the following for information given in the chapter a uh, figure and maps complete the table below so we have to study whatever information is given from the chapter also from the figures and maps also and we have to complete the table so next question is identify the 
odd man out so there is possibility this question can ask in our question number 2 in our doubt session i have explained no which type of question can ask so it is question number 2 then match the pairs it is also from question number 2 so children complete it thank you very much